guys, thanks for joining me. Today I'm going to be creating a fish using both the chain pull and acrylic swipe techniques. To create the background, I'm using aqua green, titanium white, and phthalo blue. All of those are by Artist Loft, and all the other paints that I'm going to be using today are also going to be Artist Loft paints. Once I finished the background, I gave it some time to dry and now I'm starting off by laying down my base color of titanium white, which is mixed one part paint to two parts Floetrol. This color is deep magenta. And this is light blue. I discovered this color combination when I did my orchid and I, I really liked it so I thought I'd use it again over here. To create the other fins I'm just I'm going to follow exactly the same process that I used for the first one. So both of these paints are mixed one part paint to one and a half parts Floetrol. To create the body of the fish, I'm going to swipe over various paints that have silicone in them because the silicone is what is going to create the cells. So the reason that I'm taking off this extra paint over here that's gone into the area of the body of the fish is because this paint doesn't have silicone in it and I obviously want all the paint within the body of the fish to have silicone in it. To outline the shape of the fish, I'm using titanium white um, that's mixed one part paint to two parts Floetrol, so it's the same white that I was using earlier. To prepare the body of the fish for the swipe, I'm going to lay down the colors that I'm going to swipe over. And so I'm starting by laying down deep magenta. This is light blue. This is light magenta. This is turquoise. All the colors that I'm laying down for the base are mixed four parts paint to eight parts Floetrol to one part water with one drop of silicone.
We're almost ready to do the swipe. I'm just laying down some titanium white. This white is mixed one part paint to two parts Floetrol to three parts water. So it's a thinner consistency than the other white that I was using earlier. Okay, now for my favorite part, which is doing the swipe and having the cells pop up. I'm just using a heat gun over here to help get some more cells to pop up. I'm adding a few white dots using a toothpick. Okay, so here we go with a bit of a close-up. Thanks so much for joining me today. If you'd like to see more fluid acrylic art tutorials like this, please don't forget to like, subscribe and hit the notification bell. And I look forward to seeing you again next time.